Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. We are here with another hotel room tour. This is the Toyoko Inn Shinjuku Kabuchiko and this is a non-smoking single room. We have our bed here. The bed is actually bigger than a twin or single size bed. I believe it's like a double bed size. On the right hand side as you enter you have some hangers which I've just put my clothes up here uh, as well as an air freshener bottle and one hook there. You can see my jeans hanging up. Uh, you do have room to open your suitcase if you'd like. Uh, you have enough floor space to open maybe one or two carrier style suitcases which is nice. Here we have some outlets as well as the slippers and shoe accessories. And on the left, as you enter, you of course have your key holder for the room power, the bathroom. Pretty standard business hotel style bathroom. And you do get a fancy toilet seat, which is heated and has various other features as you can see here. The bathtub is deep, but it's quite it's tiny. You couldn't lay down in it unless you were quite short. There is a dispenser for your face and body wash conditioner and shampoo. The water pressure is great and the water heat or the water temperature gets very warm if you'd like it warm as well as cool. You can see you can switch it from the sink to the shower head with this valve here. And there's really not many accessories in the bathroom. You of course do get a hand towel, bath towel. Uh, you get a bin to put your toothbrush and comb in once you're done with it to recycle them. Uh, otherwise you just get a cup. Uh, you can find like toothbrush sets in the lobby. Uh, the rest is toiletries I brought myself. And going over next to the bed, you have a magazine holder, a light here, a outlet as well as USB outlet, and a little nightstand shelf there. You have another uh, reading light here and the control for the air conditioning unit in the room. See the air conditioning unit up there. In terms of the desk area, pretty standard fare. You do have a clock, a TV. Here's more uh, things you can pick up in the lobby, tea and a comb. You have your mirror, hair dryer, phone, remote, more outlets and tissues. Below you have your electric kettle, another cup, and your in-room safe. Underneath the table or desk here you have your hotel information and a cubby to store things or put books and such. Your trash can and the refrigerator. The refrigerator is quite tiny but you can fit your beverages and such in there. Not a problem. You can say even fit a two liter bottle of water in the bottom there can fit uh, other drinks in the door or even on the tiny shelf. A uh, pretty small room. Uh, the style of hotel is not known for their very cavernous rooms, but it gets the job done for a short trip. Uh, we're actually closer to the Higashi Shinjuku station rather than Shinjuku itself. Oh, there's also a door hook on the back of the bathroom door there various lights, which is the one with the red light is actually the bathroom fan, but it's quite loud, so I've turned it off for this video. I'll have another hotel room tour for you very soon. After I move from this hotel, I will be staying in another kind of business style hotel here in Japan, so I will be sure to bring you that video as soon as possible. And thank you very much for watching. I will see you in the next one. Goodbye!